I've sat next to Lily for 20 years, been by her bedside while she's been suffering with debilitating pain for days on end. And it's heartbreaking to see how it has affected her life and those around her. So I've um, had endometriosis symptoms since I was 15. Um, I was diagnosed five years after that, but it's been a part of my every day since it started. So endometriosis for me is, is all about pain. It's chronic pain, it's acute flare-ups um, where I'm debilitated for days on end. It's affected my career and my, my education and it affects my little girls um, who see me in that state um, pretty often. The Ainsworth family have committed $50 million to establish the Ainsworth Endometriosis Research Institute. The University of New South Wales is delighted to partner with the Ainsworth family in establishing the Ainsworth Endometriosis Research Institute. This institute will bring together scientists and clinicians to look at the question of endometriosis. We still talk about endometriosis like it's one disease, but yet we know that it's so different and so variable in the women and people that present with the disease that we need to get better biological understanding. A dedicated scientific institute that is looking at the biology of endometriosis will revolutionise the disease. I really see that sufferers of endometriosis spans far beyond those who suffer the physical uh, symptoms. I see the effect that it's had on my family. Um, and I think a dedicated environment would show them that we're looked after and that we're cared for. It is a true privilege for UNSW and its partners to be part of this watershed initiative. The power of collaboration in tackling a significant issue is palpable. This partnership is a model for how we can approach complex health challenges in the future. So I'm very, very excited. The University of New South Wales is important. It, it has the researchers, it has the background. We've done a lot of work in research ourselves and to work out how best to establish a you know, institute and the university here fits the bill really well. I believe this donation is the largest philanthropic donation to women's health in Australia. We have committed $50 million over 10 years because it takes that long to make a difference in the science world. Airy is one of the most exciting things I've ever worked on in my life. This means that we can achieve results faster and we can give a dedicated group of scientists a career for the next decade. It's wonderful to be able to do this as a family and I think there are not many things in life where you, you have an opportunity to make a contribution that could really make a difference and we think that this is one of those things. We hope that ERI will make a significant difference to millions and millions of women's lives around the world. It is about making their lives more manageable so that they can see a future and live a future where they can have full, healthy and happy lives.